Hello again and welcome on Humorworks, my channel, where we talk about the cold air or tentacle air intake of the MR2 Mark I, which was very, very long in progress. It's not ready, but it's a prototype. We can mount it, see if it fits, and maybe we can test it, just find out if everything is fine. At first I bought this Tom's replica intake, but I was not really happy with that because there is no connection to the throttle body. Starting with a sketch in a vector graphic program, ending up by a 3D model I designed. It was very important that I can print that piece and that the wall size fits to the nozzle size of my 3D printer. So I printed with a full recycled PETG with a 0.8 nozzle. The first print was not that successful because the third part, as you can see, was not complete. The second print looks way better. And because it's so hot outside, I used the time to do some um, resin and fiber on it to make it a little bit more stiff. not the best lamination but time is money and it's as stiff as you can hear so we just put uh, some tape out which was in place for the resin coat and then we will test if this really do some difference I don't have a dyno so we just uh, yeah make the same like at the Suzuki counting seconds and see if this increases something on the same track. And because I'm not Mr. Masochist, I will do some duct tape around that and wrap it with duct tape because there are a lot of very sharp edges now. Zweiter Gang, 40, Shift bei 4.500. Holy crap! 
that was unexpected. It was so fast at six. Okay, that was a difference. That was really a difference. I don't have to measure that. That was a difference. Hundred twenty shifting at six thousand. Start. If you're interested in some of my projects, you can follow my channel or just leave a comment about an idea you have for 3D printing or something on the MR2 Mark I. So I'm really happy about the outcome of this video, but sadly my camera was too hot now and so the Sony Alpha don't work anymore. I don't know why. So I cannot do the measurement between um, before and after. I will see you hopefully in the next videos because here are something like the new steering wheel that we need a better corner light lever because this is a little bit short. Thanks for watching the video. Hopefully it gave you some inspiration and we can see each other in the next one.